This video serves to show you how to look up plant owned by a specific supplier. Now there's a couple of different ways that you can do this. Uh, what you need to do when you log in, go to the plant tab on the left menu bar. You will see this page here. Each piece of plant has its own row. Uh, across the top you've got tabs. So what you need to do is go to the eyeglass icon, click on that, and you're gonna see the advanced search tab. Now in this search tab, you can uh, search for a piece of plant by uh, the actual plant ID, or you might do it by the plant type. Uh, but also you can search, for example, here on rail plant, you can search by the supplier itself. So firstly, let's just take a say we know the number. So let's just type in the piece of plant we're looking for. This will filter that out. Only shows up the excavator here. If you click on that plant, it'll take you through to the plant overview page. Now, if you expand that page, you'll see more of it and expand that. Let's go back to the search filter. Just reset the filter here each time you want to do this. Go back up to the eyeglass icon. Again, let's say we don't know the uh, uh, search attribute we're looking for, but we do know the supplier. So let's go back to the supplier. Let's look for on rail. You can either type it in or scroll down. But if we type in on rail, for example, choose that, press search, or the plant of on rail will show up here. If you scroll down the page just a little bit, you'll see that they've got 26 pieces of plant. We're only showing 10 per page at the moment. If we click on here, you can expand out and put more per page. Now, the plant we looked at before was an excavator. It was 714M11. Again, click on that page. It'll take you through to the overview page. If we expand that page out, and on this page, you can see general details. You can see the status is in uh, compliance, green flag. You can scroll down that page and see all the attributes, rail gauge, track vehicle type, the ARTC class code, number of axles, the maintenance vehicle ID. Uh, but most importantly, to the right of the image here is the operating restrictions associated with that piece of plant. And also to the right of that, you have the documentations tab. If you click on that, you can be able to see all the documentations. There's four that were submitted to do uh, with that piece of plant in the application. But that gives you a quick rundown on the search functionality. Make sure you go to the plant page, always reset that filter, eyeglass up top, and then search away. Thank you.